Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending on the time and location you are tuned to our channel. Thanks a lot for the visit. You know, these UAG people are just playing with us and they are telling us come today, come tomorrow. So we have decided to diversify. We have decided to be, you know, we have to pay bills, we have to eat, we have to maintain our lives. So sitting down in one place, I advise us to move on. Move on in the essence of uh, trying to still get other streams of income, other things to do. So that's why we are doing this our channel now. We are waiting for UAG disbursement if they will disburse. Although we are hearing news that what they want to give is hundred thousand, and that's why they are now advocating that you should register as many NGOs as possible, which means they will get more money. But that aside, that is not what this video is all about. What I'm encouraging all of us now is to put uh, uh, UAG at the back of our mind, not in front of our mind meaning we should still try to look for other means to get something that is why we're doing this video now in case for your children and in case you want to apply this uh i applied this for last last year i applied for this is a ptdf i applied for it i went to abuja for interview uh, after that the names were shortlisted uh my name was not shortlisted but the first list my name was just this why i decided to say this is that uh, you know people in the east they ignore this they say government doesn't care yes government doesn't care but there are some things that the northerners are benefiting i stay in the north i stay in sokoto and there are many things that they are benefiting from here and the easterners and the west are not benefiting why because they don't apply when you don't apply you don't get you know so this is a ptdf uh, application petroleum technology development fund technology development uh, uh, petroleum technology development fund that is the meaning so this is the the portal will be in the description there are two portals this one you are looking at is the one for for the application of uh, of uh, the 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 what how to apply as in what the information the background check the information of of the portal then this particular one this particular one is is the the portal itself this particular one is the portal itself to apply you know this particular one is the portal itself you know then this one now is where we are now so let's just go through and see what this is all about petroleum technology development uh, fund is a federal government agency with the mandate of developing indigenous human capacity to meet the need of oil and gas industry mode of, of application this can be assessed from the ptdf that this uh, portal this portal that uh, we saw before all applicants are to please note the following applicant must have a valid nin you must have nin that's number one applicants who have benefited from any of the ptde scholarship in the past cannot apply if you have benefited you cannot apply applicant is restricted to federal university and the uh, specific cause that's your children if you are if you are undergraduate as in if you have gone to school from from i think it's from uh, 1990 1990 till date that's the uh, category for for in country application post graduate also that's for those that have masters phd you apply you have you are you are you can apply now the benefit of this form is that you, there are countries malaysia india indonesia uk canada united states you go and study there and full scholarship they i think it's uh, the total money they will give you it's almost uh, 100 million or i think it's almost 100 million then for your school full-time scholarship applicant must possess a full-time admission letter into the federal or any of the university you must have 2.2 the cost of study must be related to management and the uh, oil and gas possess five credits in WAEC. uh you must have your nyc exemption exclusion or discharge letter 
the statement of the last uh, you must put your, your personal statement which contains a minimum of 1000 words phd requirement those are the phd so this form i i told you now that last year i was i was uh, uh, my name came out in the first stream and about this form too it seems that this is the last time the last time the last year this form is is uh, is uh, being uh, processed i think tunubu wants to wipe it out he says that it does not circulate it's only a few because it's only the northerners that apply that's why i said to create awareness not that it's only the northerners most people that apply uh strictly from the from there is not widely spread because other parts like the east they don't care majority of them don't apply so this is the portal all these these two portals will be dropped these two links will be dropped in the description this is the portal then you this is it you you open account you open account if if you have gone before like me now as i'm going to apply and i'm going to come here existing putting my my name and my my email and my password you know my username i think i use my email and my password then you apply so but you now that is applying you this is the guideline you can read the guideline then this is it you apply the scholarship is free they don't collect money anything we do here is free because somebody that is looking for money cannot do what would you have done to us no we ain't gonna fall prey to that again so guys so if you're facing any difficulty because the form is uh, is a very loaded form. When you, when you open an account, you will see it. If you face any difficulty, feel free to communicate with me. My WhatsApp uh, number, as in the link to my WhatsApp, is in the description. The link to all this is in the description. So see you, see you in the next time. Bye for now.